Boom. Unpopular opinion, having a stick is unnecessary extra steps. <sighs> I guess. I mean, most new cars today are automatic. It's older cars that are stick. Like, all, you know, cars that are made today are, are automatic. I don't, I don't know if it's... A, I don't know if that's an unpopular opinion. I don't... I, I, it's just... We're slowly shifting now. Like, no. I'd say it's probably more fun to drive with manual. But I don't think today there's any reason for manual. I'm happy if somebody can tell me there's a reason for manual over automatic, then let me know. I'm curious, but I'd imagine that there's no, I'd imagine it's more efficient with automatic today for drifting. Yeah, you're right. <laughs> of all things I'd see. Didn't expect drifting. Yeah, yeah, true. We're always coming in drifting in the city as well. <laughs> yeah, of course there are differences, but I don't think that it's such an unpopular statement to say something like that. I think some people just prefer manual. <clears throat> Keeps your brain more active as well. Uh, I'd imagine if you compared driving accidents i'm gonna come out with a wild statement based off of nothing i imagine if you compare accidents ooh, maybe not actually i'd imagine more people if we talk about late night uh accidents i imagine more accidents happen on automatic than manual because i imagine that more people are falling asleep driving automatic than manual that's going to be my statement based off of nothing but my own opinion. I kind of started disagreeing with myself because I realized that maybe there it evens out because people make more mistakes with manual than automatic. So maybe, maybe not. Maybe I'm off. But um, that was that was my two statements. But yeah, I feel like it would be way easier to fall asleep on automatic compared to um, uh, manual because you're st staying busy, you know. <laughs> Manuals, you can't just floor it as well. Very true. Very, very true. Yeah, with an automatic, you can just... You know? Just fucking go for it. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, you're in more control, maybe, in manual. Again, basing this off of absolutely nothing. Just opinion. Or just get an electric. Well, I have an electric automatic, you know, so... I know that the, the whole, like, just pedal to the metal, just fucking going, it's very, um, very, uh, it's very easy. Yeah. Yeah. <sighs> Are there electric manuals? I don't think so. I don't know, Matt. Wouldn't an electric manual be, like, fake? Are there electric manuals? I don't think that's... There's no point to that, no? Electric cars, it's not the same as, like, an engine engine. I don't think that that's impossible. You can't have electric manuals. It would, it would be, um... Oh fuck, I forgot about this game. It would be, um... Manual. They'd have just... It's cosmetic, yeah. <clears throat> you can have gears in an electric car, but they're useless. Mm. The engine is a battery, no? Yeah, but there's no need for, uh... Like, gearboxes. Have you guys seen the... Did you see the... Was it a... I'm real talkative today. We're meant to be playing. Uh, have, did, <laughs> did you see 
did you see the um Mustang? Was it a Mustang they came with that was electric? And they added like a you know, but it was just like it's just a speaker. Did you guys see that? It was just a heavy just you know, and it's literally just like everybody knows that it's just speakers that they have on it because it's electric. I can't remember what car that was. It was coming out of like a they were showcasing it. It was coming out. Oh, surely. Does anyone? I need a hold on. The, no. No, it was like a sports looking car. It was like a Mustang, wasn't it? Was it the... Yeah, I can't find it. There was a video where it was like slowly driving around. No, I don't think it was a Mackie. How do you pronounce this? Mach? No, no, no. It was like it was like a proper like low rider. Tio based on Mercedes. Was it? No. Electric Hellcat? Oh, it was, it was like, it was a clip of them showcasing. Here it is! It sounds the same. <laughs> this one's even funnier. I love electric cars. I don't think I don't think doing this is gonna get anyone to be like, yeah, fuck yeah, okay. If anything, you're just pushing car enthusiasts away more by doing something like this. That's what I think. Like, I think that you're just turning them off. Uh. <laughs> okay. Ah. <sighs> Yeah, I mean, some electric cars, they do add an artificial sound because they're too quiet. <clears throat> That's what our car does. It's an angelic sound. Imagine like a ah, as you're driving around. Yeah. What electric car did you get? How about I can't remember. It is? No, stop. Can't remember what we're doing. Detonator. We have to go down. We have to go down deep into the mines. The mines of Moria. And get um, the detonator. Chevy Bolt EUV. I can go record it. No, rest. Stop it. Don't go record your engine sound for it. You, we could do that another day. <laughs> All 
Alright, are we done with the engine talk? Anyone have any other point that we're- are we good? <laughs> I don't- I'm not gonna walk around in a horror game talking about cars. We're good, yeah? We're good. Yeah, we're good. No one has anything. Yeah, we're done. Okay. Um, we're playing Amnesia. The game is fun. For those who are wondering what they missed yesterday, I need to do a socials post. <laughs> All right, fuck it. I misspelled it. It's okay. I'm stressed. People are annoyed. Where's my phone? I'm on the wrong account! Okay. <coughs> hey, fuckers! I'm live right now. We're continuing Amnesia. Gonna have a great time. Get a little spooky. Have a little fun. See you in chat. Okay, so. This is Amnesia. We played the first sesh yesterday. Can we disable? I can just turn it off. I hate it. And I want to oh! I uh, I want to enjoy the um the um the story of uh, the final. I was actually going to say that I don't think I'm like jumpy today, but it's okay. It's pretty, pretty good. The game is um good. It's good. If you haven't watched the first session, somebody asked for a summary earlier. Our name is... Our name's something. And we have amnesia. We're down here. It's World War I. We woke up here. We did something horrible, according to the notes. And we are looking to... Uh, solve it. Find out what. We're also looking to get out of here. And we've done all kinds of stuff. We got some dynamite, which I'm actually going to put away. Um, what's her name? Henri. We're French. Now we need the detonator handle, which is down in the arsenal. There's some sort of big car. I mean, uh, <laughs> there's, there's some sort of big uh, dog running around down here. <laughs> uh, I'm still on that topic in my head. Uh, I, there's some sort of big dog running around on here, who's, uh, <laughs> it's running around on here and it's, uh, fucking us up. Um. That's it. Did I miss any notes? No, we're good. Why is this highlighted? No, fine. Where is it? Where is it? Let's listen to Hobo's angelic electric car. What the fuck? This is how your car sounds? You weren't kidding. It's angelic. Electric cars sound weird? This is not ele all electric cars. My car does not sound like this. My car just sounds like a car. <laughs> but like, more of a hum than like a hum. Does your car always sound like this? Just driving. Why would they do that? I'm <laughs> mine, mine just sounds like an electric car, you know, it doesn't quite sound like an engine, but it does not sound like that. It's just, it just sounds like an electric engine. Interesting. That's, uh, I really wasn't expecting it to actually sound angelic. 
Du, 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 du. Du, du. I have a Skoda. 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 Uh, Skoda Enyaq. I don't remember. Are we going here? Yeah. Is it simply clever? Skoda. Skoda. Simply clever. <clears throat> the Skoda Enyaq IV80. In an electric blue. It's a bit of an SUV. It's like borderline SUV. Somewhere kind of in between. Skoda. Simply clever. Alright, I don't know how to deal with this. Hmm. Maybe this is why I need to go to the prison. The stick? Maybe... Oh, you know what we need? We need a shirt, a rag, and a stick. We pee on the rag, and then wrap it around two bars, put the stick in between, and start twisting. And it'll bend the bars so that we can fit through. Who knows the movie? Who knows the movie? It's Jackie Chan. Shanghai Nights! Hell yeah. Who said that? Yunas. Well done. Or maybe Shanghai Noon. One of them. Oh, I could easily watch those movies again, man. They were good. What does P do with it? You just need liquid, and if you're in a cell trapped, then that's the only liquid you're gonna get. My sense higher today? Uh, right, so. My sense is really high all of a sudden. Uh, I think we need to go to the prison. Have you seen Rush Hour recently? I forgot how controversial it is. Straight ahead. Uh, really? Is it? Oh, do they make a lot of... Who? You! Me? No, not me! Who? You know, they do a lot of like... Haha! <laughs> Asians! <laughs> Is it really that controversial? I don't remember anything that bad. I'm gonna turn on the generator before I go. Jackie says the N-word? <laughs> There's a bunch of racist stereotypes. He says the N-word in it, really? <laughs> Yeah, I mean, they play a lot on uh, racial stereotypes in that movie, to be fair. I'm gonna save before I turn this on. They're not controversial, people are offended easily. I mean, I don't think Cake's offended. He's just saying that it's controversial. You cannot tell me! that saying the n-word in a movie isn't considered controversial. Let Cake say that that's controversial. Nobody said they're offended. I was looking the other day if, um, Tropic Thunder is still on- if it's on Amazon Prime, because I would love to do a watch party with that. I think it'd be so much fun, man. I haven't seen that in years.
Oh shit! What the fuck? Oh my god! Oh, he just comes out! Oh, that's really cool! But I gotta go! Sayonara. I do have one bullet. I wasn't really sure. I'd love to get a Tropic Thunder too, man. I don't think we will, sadly. It's such a funny film. I hope we get into an era of comedy movies again, man. Oh, this is... Yeah, I need a gas mask. Maybe we go to... Hmm. Hold on. What codes do I have? We have Clement and Naval. Let's go check out their lockers. Where are their lockers? Here on the right, right? This gas spread far. True, Henfer. Yeah, Bora 2 was not quite the same. 8120 for Clement. <clears throat> I think, um,. Tom Cruise said he'd love to revisit the producer role that he played. So, I mean, maybe once he, in a few years, once he's a little bit older and can't really do all these action movies, maybe he'd <clears throat> be the front runner. En Laval, 9906. Gas mask! Ooh, nice. Oh, that's so satisfying. Also terrifying. Holy shit. That was cool. I really like that. Okay, uh, right, we gotta get to prison. I wonder if he's guarding that. I have to find some way to lure him out or something. Um, we'll find out. Let's... I don't think it's enough to do a full med kit. I am a little hurt, but... Not enough. Piece of wood. Hmm. Flare. Flashlight. <sighs> Note we get. 8th of July, <clears throat> mid-afternoon. Joubert needs a scout for tonight. Routine is my journal. Patrol. Out to the communication wires and back. It'll be cloudy. Good cover. Easiest patrol possible. Sergeant wants me or Augustin to go. He still suspects one of us might have been with the mutineers. But I won't be going. How can I be so sure? Well, Augustin has agreed to a friendly game of chance to determine which of us it will be. And... 
using an old sleight of hand Ooh. trick. There's no way I'll lose. Do you think that's what I did? <laughs> I cheated? No. Augustin doesn't have a chance because I'll ensure he doesn't. And then Augustin Me? died? A scoundrel? <laughs> Perhaps. But when he returns and I remind him of the time he pissed in my flask, or the mysterious lice that appeared in my bunk, or the incident with that barmaid, <laughs> well, I laughed in those cases, and he'll laugh in this one. 8th of July, near midnight. Shelling again somewhere along the line. Them firing at us. I'm sure we will fire at them again soon. I hope Augustan's having a simply marvelous time. Out there. <laughs> Can't wait to tell him what I did. 9th of July, time unknown. It must be just before dawn. When the shelling stopped, I woke. The sudden silence always does that. Augustin's bunk is... empty. I went looking for him. He wasn't in the mess, nor being seen by Dr. Jozinski, nor lurking out for a final smoke. Dax was on patrol. I asked him. He said Augustin hasn't returned from the scout. He said the words like he was pronouncing Augustin's death. As if scouts don't come running back at all hours. As if... as if it wasn't just a routine patrol. As if... all hope was lost. Now the shelling is starting again. Uh, we'll try to sleep. 9th of July, morning. It has been hours now and Augustin has not returned. His luck did not hold. And neither has mine. What could I have been thinking? If he is gone forever... But I do not want to write it, for fear writing it will make it real. I will continue to wait in my bunk until dusk. And if there is no sign of him, then... Then... Then I do not know. The priest keeps staring at me, as if he can sense I have some unseen weight on me. I will not give him the satisfaction of a confession. It was nothing. A joke. I, I thought it was just a joke. I, I never thought. I yeah, okay. I never thought. And therein lies my sin. So he's been talking about doing something horrible. And we didn't know what it was. This thing I've done, this thing, this thing. I'm in a state of agony. Uh, still, of course, no word. They're all laughing. Do they suspect it? I feel they may almost be guilty of something, and yet they laugh, drink, argue. God knows what I've done. Because judgment, you know, he's really feeling bad. And he talks about having to do something even if it costs him his uh, own life. And now we found out what it is. So he cheated. It's not that bad. He cheated. They had to play a game to see who would go outside for patrol. And he cheated. And then Augustine died. I wonder what we ended up doing that gave us amnesia, though. Unless we know that. I don't think we know that. Or is that just when we went outside and we got hit by the shell? There must be more to it. Do you think it was the attack in the intro? Hmm. Oh, we got a photo as well. Oh, it's, it's me and Lambert, the guy in the, uh, intro. He's now dead with the rest of them. Oh! The comment of the year! I have Darkwood on Epic Games, but I didn't see if you played it. Do you recommend it? Oh no, didn't see you play it. Do you recommend it? Quick summary. Oh, you know I played it. Ah, okay. Comment on the month. It's a great game. Go play it. Best game out there. Have fun, man. Enjoy it, and just savor it. Take your time. Want good game. Wonderful game. Great game. Enjoy. Yeah. Ooh, really good. I have a huge mosquito bite. What the hell? It's swollen. Okay. <laughs> the 
If I don't like it, what do I get in return? Uh, you get banned from my channel. What's he saying? Gott in Himmel. Is that what? Gott in Himmel. Good in the in the sky. Ah, oh, for the good of the sky. What does Gott mean? Oh, is that how you say God? Not oh, fair. <clears throat> good in Himmel. Ah. That's what he'd say if it was dubbed in Swedish, with that kind of enthusiasm as well. <laughs> what the fuck is this? Oh, it's because I'm hurt. Oh, fuck off. Ooh, I surf! Nice! Dude, this prison place is tough. He keeps blocking my way and I have nowhere to go. Uh, I wonder if I have to outsmart him. So, Gott is how you say God in German? Wouldn't I guess it? Perfect. He's, a, he's behind me. Why does it sound like he's running? What? This isn't World War Two. This is World War One. <laughs> he did not leave. Oh, he's right here licking.
Oh, I'm bleeding. He can smell me. It's gone. He finished the stand. They've got some hidden mechanics. He was like 10 meters away. I wonder if that's intentional. No, he can't hear me. Well, he can hear me walking, but the reason he's finding me is because I'm, I'm um, wounded. Okay, we need to do something here, and I don't know what it is. We're a little bit stuck. Unfortunately, we have to use a med kit, which sucks, because I don't think I'm that hurt, but oh well. Hmm. I need to get down to the tunnels in Arsenal, but there's a chain in the way. I suspect I need to find some ching ching for that. What I could do is check out... I, need to, I mean, the prison, I don't see what I'm meant to do there right now. Yeah, some bolt cutters. Exactly. I don't think I fully vibed in maintenance. I think I was in and out quite quickly. I think I'm going to go check out the maintenance room. And see if I can find some more stuff there. So that's out the door. Deep, deep. Left, deep. I have a very limited amount of ammo, guys. I'm not going to start shooting it left, right, and center. Unless I've got something really important on me and I want to survive. Uh, well, that's annoying. Now I'm bleeding. It's just one. I The rats... You know what? I'll say it. The rats suck. Have I been... Oh, I haven't been here. I don't, have I been here even? I don't... What the fuck is happening? I... Whoop! Whoop! whoop. I'm stuck. I this room. What am I meant to... Hey, here's my flashlight. It's loud. When I wind it up.
rats. <sighs> okay, let's let's have a look at what we have here. There's there's I need anything I can use against these rats. I Bottle? Check. Stick, no. I'll try the flare. Signals with its brightly burning and loudly hissing flame can be thrown. When in need of aid. Dude, do you think that scares the monster? Do you think I could stand on the flare? And he won't come to me because he's scared? Or just hold it, yeah. I don't, I don't know. It. I thought maybe I'd carry it. I mean, like, I, I can't walk past these guys. I'm, I'm just gonna get hurt. Let me go find some stuff. I'm a fun. Why? Why? Am I hurt right now? Oh, I'm bloody. Oh, this save is before I healed myself. Oh, these rats are driving me insane, dude. <laughs> Fuck, fuck off! We're not starting off great today. <laughs> I think I need to do a supply run. Um, unless they're gone now that... No, they're blocking the way. I need I need to go get supplies. Yeah, we're doing a scab run. Uh and uh uh what was it? Quarters. Quarters has a lot of stuff. Get the quarters, I can go scab run.
Nice. I have full inventory. Uh, I should go back with this. This is a lot of good stuff. Happy to drop the bottle. I don't think I need that. See if I find some bandages. That's nice. Uh, Prison. Oh no. Okay, go back. Well, I wanted to bait him through that door so I could go around. Because if he hears me when I'm walking by, he comes out on the side door. Oh no. Oh, but I have so much loot. Okie dokie. Fuck it. Jesus, Vina. Ich will nicht zerstören. Bitte. Bitte. He might just have broken the door down for me. Okay, progress. Progress, progress, progress. So. So I now have a mission in the prison to get those bolt cutters. And I wonder how I'm gonna do that. My conscience compels me now as it failed to compel me then. 
I must do something, even if it costs me my own life. I must do something, lest I never sleep again. I must do something, or risk greeting hell itself as a relief. I must do something. I go. That wasn't even the one. What was I reading? This is the one I just found. Dearest, thank you for the pa- oh my god, okay. <clears throat> thank you for the package, I'm saving the chocolate for a special occasion and I'm keeping the photo close to my heart. It's been weeks now since I've been called for my, any combat action, but a new kind of fear is spreading inside the bunker. Last night I woke up with a chill, a strange sound was emanating from deeper in the bunker, a kind of moan, a cry, perhaps a howl. Went to investigate and found myself standing at the entryway to the Roman tunnels, the sound came from inside. I dared not shine a light inside for fear of what I might see. Then a scrambling thudding came racing towards me from the darkness, a shape loomed out of the shadows. I reached for my sidearm, ready to fire. It was Toussaint. He'd been awakened as well, but unlike me, he dared to enter the tunnels. He says he saw something there. So he stood at that now, listening. The howling, howling, howling grew distant. Receded to where I dare not guess. Perhaps our minds are gone. Or perhaps there's something down there. Toussaint will not tell me what he saw. Tell me, uh, please write me again. Love to you, Johannes. Johannes. Hmm. So, one of the... I might want to keep this, actually. I think I want to use it for taking care of some rats. You can pour it, apparently, on the ground and then light it a fire. Light it a fire? Light it up. I think he wrote a note about what he saw down there. I thought so, except I'm not seeing it. Very annoying. It would be marked like this. I think what he did was just mark this. That's why it went. Um, I'm gonna assume I need a grenade or something for that. But now that I've gotten some stuff, we can maybe try the maintenance again. Now that I have both a gas grenade and fuel, I think I can make it into maintenance. Toussaint is in your notes. I mean, that's... Yeah, I know, but that's old stuff. <clears throat> that note that I just read was uh, an old note. I, or, it's one I found during my scav run. Do I want to leave anything? I think I'm going to need some space. I'm actually going to leave the flare. I'll need the fuel, gas, and gas mask. No, the fuel is for the rats. I need that. Are you going to get the bolt cutters? I haven't figured that part out yet. I wonder if there are meds here that I've missed. Maybe I left some meds because I have full inventory or something? Oh, bolt cutters. I need them. I need them. Hello. God, this feels like such a waste, though. Can I use some of the ga the fuel, and not all of it? Is there no block around? Because I can throw like blocks. If they're heavy enough. Be poured in empty bottles or on the ground. Oh, so I can Molotov it. Do I have a bottle back in my storage? Dropped the bottle, didn't I? For some other stuff. 
All right, cast grenade it is. That's what we're gonna use. No, fuel. I think fuel gas grenade is more rare. Block in the way, man. I. Sayonara. <laughs> I did that worked once. <laughs> did I accidentally lit some gas on fire once? When I I was next to fuel and I started doing that. It lit up the... Is that not... I swear that worked before. Was that not what happened? <laughs> I was a little surprised when it happened. You expected a flashlight during night fuel? It happened! Okay? At least I thought it did. But maybe I misunderstood what happened. <laughs> I figured a little spark comes or something and then it spreads in the fuel. You know... Fuel is not only flammable in the actual flu, but in the, um, what? In the actual fluid, but also in the close air above it. Oh, oh. So, the vapors, exactly. All I gotta do is just ksh, ksh, watch. It's, it's an RNG thing, man. Watch this. <laughs> Who said that? You were fucking challenging him to a, pa a Beyblade battle? That's so good. That's such a funny comment, dude. Let it rip! I'm not gonna let it go to waste. I have to find out if this works. <laughs> I don't know what happened that time then. I don't know, man. I mean, I could shoot it. But I may as well have just shot the actual rats. We're doing a YOLO run. I need another cloth! I need another cloth!
Back off. Back off. The rat, dude. <laughs> Occupy. <laughs> you mom and dad I gotta find meds I mean, this is a fucking nightmare of a round, or is this- Oh, there's so much fuel in here. Uh, I'm wasting so much- so many resources just to like- What, what am I doing here, man? I, I- I- I feel like I need a plan. Should I- Should I kill myself? Oh, well. We learn! <gasps> we learn! We learn. <laughs> oh, shit. Alright, I now have a game plan. <laughs> I now have a game plan. We, um, here's what we're gonna do. I don't need a gas grenade. I don't need fuel. I just need the flare. Don't need the gas mask. Professional amnesia gameplay coming in hard, hard. I can't speak. Never mind. Well, why does it roll so far? I mean, like. <sighs> what is it lubed up, man? Like, what's what's going on there? Okay.
That's what happened. That's what happened. I was wondering what happened. He's in there. Oh, great. Oh, great. Great. Okay, just... Who's this mini boss? Okay, please go. Can you- thank you. The way he fucking- <laughs> He walks up to the door, slowly turns towards me, <laughs> and just- You're gonna have to get through me. These rats are gonna be the fucking end of me, man. I... Okay, well, you know what? If we're gonna do this, then I may as well do this. The plank! Move it! Why? This is some fucking bullshit, man. Why is this section so difficult? <laughs> Are you guarding here again? No, they're gone now. Okay, I didn't need the flare then. left.
Perfect. Thank... Thank you. I can go up at pillbox. Interesting. I might drop one fuel here for something else. Yeah, can I use? Can I? Nice. Okay, cool. Petrol bar. Fuel or. We're gonna hurry. Uh, we're gonna get off. We're gonna fuel. Check what's in here. It's good to know what's here. Nothing. We're gonna. One of the bottle. Yeah, we're gonna go. We're gonna go. We're gonna go back. I'm happy with that. That's a good run. We're gonna go back. Why, why would it? Why wouldn't that scare them all off? These rats are really starting to piss me off. The way they keep blocking where I need to go. I. <sighs> all right. Well, let's bandage up. Get the generator going, maybe? Just give me some... Time? Just one generator, I think. Just for a little bit of time in there. Because I think he doesn't come out as often as he does that. Ooh, we have a lot of stuff, actually. Hold on. Notes. Note to a dead friend. Gavi, I promised you a Christian burial, but you must understand. The rats would not stop coming. They swarmed your body, their teeth, their claws. They would not stop. I did what our ancestors did when faced with unclean things. I burnt them all, and I burnt what was left of you to stop them coming again. If you've made it to heaven, uh, please forgive me. I remain down here in hell with that gray man. 
<coughs> it will come for me again soon. But I know it. I know it deep down in the core of my body. Just as I know, we will come for it. I'm going to do as you suggested before you died. Make for the pillbox. Please. If you're up there, watch over me. I ad-libbed a little there. I don't know if you guys noticed. Threw in a few lines. Kind of a vibe I thought he was going for. I don't know if anyone picked up on that, but... I can do that. Throw in a little creative lines. Stafford, have you noticed how the rats have changed down here lately? Ever since they opened up those damn tunnels, I swear the rats have gotten uglier. Yes, actually. Thank you. Like they're disfigured or something, and they're definitely more aggressive. Tell me I'm not going crazy. Hmm. Dude, badass fucking picture. Girard, twenty-four A lighter can be used to set fires. Mm, nice. If it's unlimited, yeah, I don't know. <gasps> oh, ooh. When other methods are unavailable, a simple torch can light the darkness and be swung to scare off small scavengers and predators. Ooh, when will I use this, though? When is the time to use this? I don't know. It's not now. It's not now. No, I don't want these now. Yeah, but there aren't that- are there a lot of rats down there? Do you think I should use it now? I feel like I'll come to a point where I'm like, I would have loved a torch right now. Yeah. Yeah. You think I should be using it now? I imagine it's a one-time use, yeah. Yo! What the fuck? I thought you'd- Oh my god, okay, it's lit. It's lit. <laughs> I need to- Oh, okay. Well, now we've saved it being li lighted. Let's- let's not do the generator. <laughs> he just fucking lights it? I- I, th I thought I'd have to, like, pick the light. <laughs> Here we come! Stay back! Stay back! Oh, it said predators as well. I wonder if I can scare him off with this. It's already
know why he left. This is good. This, you know, this is what I want. This I love. Fuel, 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 fuel. Beautiful. Oh, fuck them all. I'll kill them all. Yeah. I'm thinking I'm back. Come on. 8 out of 10? Yeah. What do we think? People keep asking. Oh, he's not 80 years old. No, okay. Never mind. This is the last bit. Basket. People keep asking me if I'm back. I haven't really known what to say. <laughs> what? Hello? What the fuck? I Stressful fucking torch moment. Can, why is what? Okay. Um. Okay, I'm gonna bring the pet. I'm gonna bring a gas grenade. As well as the gas mask. I guess. And then no. How do I take? I need that tunnel taken care of. Do you think if I sprint all the way, I can make it with the torch before it goes out? I need to take care of the rats in that tunnel. I'll bring the flare, fuck it. Just the flare. I'll just throw the flare at them. But it's- ah, it's deep though. It's deep. You know what I really need? I need a torch. Yeah. It's great that this automatically lit. No, I can't- I- I can't read the letter because I died.
I'm so special. <laughs> okay, we're good. The timer's actually paused on it when it's in there, so I think we're good. Um... I don't, I, I don't know what I'm saving it for, though, like... Uh, well, hold on. Is the timer going? I, I think I'm good. If I just wait... Yeah, if I wait to whip it out. Okay, torch time. It does say it's lit. I don't know if it's been... Oh, I need the lighter. I... Yeah. I figured it was lit, you know, and that I had glitched the system. Come on, hurry, 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 hurry. Fuck off, fuck off. Okay. Well, if I put it away now... Is it still... Okay, that pauses it, I think. I don't have to stress. walked into. There. That's what I walked into last time. Oh, a stick! Fuck, man. I can do another, uh, schlab -a -da -blue -blue. Oh, 
I need a quick break. Uh, Here's the pill. If you require pillbox access, see me or Doc Father Derai. We're both in possession of a key. Foreman Stafford. Father is probably in the chapel. So let's. That's on the left. See there, I go check out what's down where I broke the lock. Um. I'm trapped, aren't I? Cause... I don't have a mask. Uh... We're gonna have to wait. Pressing well. Allodoxophobia is the fear of other people's opinions. It's a rare social phobia that's characterized by an irrational and overwhelming fear of what other people think. about anything so they like if I'm on here and I'm like what do you guys think about apples do they just like oh, you know like do they like freak out at that just panic at the idea of getting people's opinions on apples incredible the human mind man the fact that that exists Part of the game seems quite hard, you're handling it well, to be honest. Thanks. This- it's really ramped up the difficulty here. <clears throat> I'm working on it. It may not look like it, but I'm trying really hard here. <laughs> I'm really trying. This gas is staying for quite some time, huh? Oh, it's what they think about them, not things. Oh, okay. It's a great way of ensuring if I have a gas mask, I could do the gas and then I can just go around freely without worrying about the monster coming. It's a nice safe zone. However, I don't have a mask, so at this point, this sucks. I am officially trapped. I'm gonna die if I go through this tunnel. The rats are gonna kill me. Uh, I got no way. There's nothing here. This door is locked. That door is locked. I simply have to wait for the gas to disappear. The torch won't get me all the way in, it'll die before I reach the end. Um, yeah, it's, it's almost dead. It, it, it'll die before I, maybe even before I remove these rats. Plus I want to go deeper. I want to go to the chapel or downstairs. Here we go. Uh, let's do downstairs. I shot the lock and all. Let's finish it. did this?
Oh, thank you. More space. I don't see- oh yeah, one more spot. Father, are you in here? 11th of July, 1916. Dusk. <gasps> Lambert's journal! The bedside of my dear friend, Henri it's my friend. The doctor has left, but I remain. He sat I feel by me. I must record the extraordinary twists of fate and fortune that have led me to be here. Breathing. Alive. Strong and well. While Henri lies unconscious. Fighting for his life. It starts days ago. On a night patrol. I fell into some kind of pit. I was injured. Unable to move. Unable to escape. By all rights, it should have been my tomb. Oh, that was in the intro. For help. We saved him. Of course. The effort left me parched. Exhausted and still alone. As the next night fell, as I cried what might have been my last cry for help, I could see the stars high, high above, beautiful, indifferent. And then Clement's face appeared at the top of the pit. He lowered himself to me, found a trickle of spring water there, and had me drink from it. It was cool and crisp with a strange, Sweet taste. Never has water felt more nourishing than that. Administered by a dear friend's hand. I was saved. But of course, that is not the last twist fate's blade would stab into my back. 11th of July, 1916. Night. Later now, I continue my tale. As Clément carried me across no man's land, fate struck again. A German outpost spotted us. Gunfire, explosions, desperation. And as the air cleared, I pulled myself to my feet and saw that Henri was wounded, blood pouring from his head, his eyes glassy. He was fading. I do not know where I found the strength to carry him, but carry him I did, all the way back to our bunker. 12th July, 1916, morning. Woke this morning and realized that a toy I purchased for my son is gone. I promised him I'd bring him something home from the front, so I brought him a stuffed rabbit from a local shop. <laughs> a rabbit because he thinks he's so fast. It must have fallen from my pack when I fell into the crater. The thought of that stuffed rabbit lying in that crater, rain and weather matting its fur, unloved, forgotten, totally alone, lost forever. It fills me with profound hopelessness. 12th July 1916, afternoon, spoke to the doctor. He told me Henri woke in the night and had no recollection of the events in the crater. Indeed, he seemed even confused as to where he was. Aside from this disturbing news, I'm feeling rather good, stronger and stronger, as if the whole ordeal has filled both my body and soul with new purpose. Okay, so the amnesia seems to be mainly about what we already know, because we did it in the intro. There doesn't seem to be much more in terms of if something happened. Uh, so far, unless they reveal something. So are we going to talk about what happened here? Surely I'll find out, right? Whoopsie daisy. I hear him. He's going to smell me. I need to heal.
sorry, father. <laughs> I... I have to leave you here. Take the key and lock? No. Uh... Ooh, that's how I get into the other room. But uh, what's going on above me here? Suddenly, the horror of the story hits so much horror. Harder. <laughs> We're stuck down here with a monster trying to get out. That's what everyone's been down, you know. They have this one exit they've been trying to get through and it's blocked off. And they have here, they can leave probably through here, but... The war is still going on. They're still out here. Yeah, blood! They're still out. This is... Oh, this... Mmm. Oh, I really, really like that. Listen to that. There are gunshots still in the distance. There's still... The war is still going on. And you tend to forget that when you're down in the underground bunkers, you know? Dealing with this freak show. You just forget about the war, because you're just one-on-one -on -one with this beast. And then, after hours not remembering anything and making it up thinking, Oh my god, I can get out of here. You get reminded. I can't get out- these people don't know, like... And maybe in this moment I'm thinking, this is all pointless what we're doing here, human v human. Like, down here, this is- this is- none of this really matters. This is true survival. And yet, we can't leave. Beautiful storytelling. I really... That's really hit me. This is a real Teo's Gasm, man. This is a nice... This is a nice moment in the game. Wouldn't you agree? Yeah, look at this, like... Maybe he even tried to get out, you know? He's like, oh fuck, like, help, there's a- and then he gets sniped. Right in the eye, you know? None, none of it fucking mattered, just when you thought you're out. They pulled me back in. No, but just when he thought he was out, you know, he gets fucking sniped by this, like, sniper, and like, what a useless, pointless way to die. Ah, oh, lovely, lovely, mm, nice. I, I, I'm, I've seen questions whether it's possible to get sniped. I don't think I'm going to tempt fate, because I've made a lot of progress here without saving. Ooh, hold the helmet up. Yeah. Let me hold this.
devs, if you see this, add a patch. Please add a patch. So that if you hold the hel helmet up, it gets sniped. Ah, oh, that would- that would be really cool. That would- that would be really cool. God, and like... Oh, just like that, you're reminded of the nightmare that you're in. Do I go out- go out here... ...to... ...sudden death? I'll die, 100%, but... ...it'll be swift... ...it'll be nice, you know, or... ...do I take my chances with the monster? Cool. My man, that's what you should have done. Why can I pick up his- oh. It's a live patch! <laughs> Peekaboo! Uh, yeah, I'm not gonna do that. So... He's down there right now. Oh my god. I... Oh, he broke the... He broke the door. Nice. I can go through it. Thank you. <laughs> well, he's kind of camping it. I don't know what I'm... Oh, this is... Mm. The horror of, like, war. Versus the nightmare. That is this bunker. He's coming back, so I'm gonna... <laughs> I'm gonna... Okay, oh shit. Yep. back down. Oh, I've, I've gotten so much good stuff. Oh, I, I don't want to die. Um, I'm going to create some inventory space. <clears throat> How many shots do I have? Two. Two bullets.
Yeah, we have to get out of here. What a, what a run, though. Well done, chat. Many close calls, but we made it in the end. Woo! Mitcherizer, Amox Propelled Horse. Thanks for subbing, guys. Welcome. Two bullets in a dream. Now we have a grenade. I... I'll be honest. That was great. But... I don't know what we can do differently now. Who is it? Where did I see the bolt cutters? They're with the prisoner. Aren't they? The prisoner has the bolt cutters. Do you reckon a nade will blow it up? What do we think? Yeah, I got some locker codes. I might check in the locker see if I find something better. Molotov? I don't think the Molotov will do it. Codes. Boucher, Traverse, and Stafford. Poacher, 0970. Nice, huge. Stafford, Sound effect. What did I pick up? Needs the lore. All right. A wrench. Nice. Ooh, there are places I can use that. Lovely stuff. How are you, man? You sub. You resub. I quit my job yesterday. I've never felt better. Just want to say hi. I'll have way more time to enjoy your live content. Happy I'm a part of this community. Aww. Congrats, man. That's really nice. Oh, I wonder if I can unscrew the door with the wrench. We're going to try. I 
I'm gonna bring one nade and one wrench. I think. is the best time to visit Sweden? Depends what part of Sweden you're going to. Sweden is a very vertical country. In case you didn't know what vertical... <laughs> it's not horizontal, it's vertical. <laughs> Sweden is a very vertical country. There's a lot top to bottom, very different, you know, so depends where you're going. The bottom part? I mean, if you want to go skiing, you want to go in the winter, right? Um, but, yeah, you know, anywhere between May and September is very lovely. I'd say, like, I mean, July, August is lovely. Uh, I've forgotten what the hell I'm doing. I'm going to the prison. I think, like, late August. I mean, if you just want heat, heat, then it's going to lie. How did we open the other one? With like an explosion? Or? Hello, I've come to find out how I get in here. Um. I mean, I think this is only for those, like, little ones I keep seeing, but I never know. Hmm. I don't think the grenade will work. Oh, it's here. Hey, man. Um, just quiet down for a sec, will you? What? Um, quiet down, man. Here. There's a way to get these. Holy shit! What the fuck? There's a way to get these open. A key? I don't see where you're meant to use it. Hmm. No, I saw, I saw that. All of them have it, but that's. Nothing giving me anything to do. Power's on right now, maybe there's a switch. Maybe I have to get in there and open them. Oh shit, am I killing you? Shame. Oh, what a cool shot. Really, really cool shot. Look at this. Oh. That's really nice. He's coming though, so we gotta go. Break it open. Break it open. 
Oh, he's slamming it open. He's Holy shit! Oh, I did a 180! <laughs> shit! I think I'm- I'm giving him a little too much respect. I need to... <laughs> okay. I know what to do. Um... Okay. I shoot it! Not enough, you mean? Perhaps not enough, yeah. Can you save the German? I don't think so. I mean, I need to get in there, and I think he does. I don't think there's anything I can do for him. We can try. I can try. I can... Okay, you know what? Operation Save Lucas. Uh, we don't... We're gonna need a nade. What are we gonna need here? We're gonna need... The flare. <laughs> We're gonna need the flare. Yeah. Oh, this is gonna be cool as hell. This is gonna be so sick. We're gonna get a gas grenade and a gas mask as well. Whoo! Here we go. Not a, he's not a Nazi. It's, it's World War One, guys. I've, I've seen too many times have I seen people call the Germans Nazis. <laughs> wrong war, wrong war. Come on, here we go. Uh, I gotta be quick for the generator. Oh, this is gonna be so sick, though. I would say people are probably getting it wrong because they think it's World War II. I hope. I can't trap him himself. He'll just... There are holes in them. He'll just leave. That bounced. Fuck. Okay, I'm coming, I'm coming. I'm coming, buddy! <laughs> buddy? I gotta try this. I gotta try this. I'm gonna go more hands-on this time. Um... No. No, I believe in the gas. No, but then he'll die. The flare. It's the flare. No, shooting them doesn't do that much. They're just stunned for like a... 10 seconds. You open only his cell? I don't know what that'll do. I think he'll still go to kill him. Alright, Operation Save Lucas. Attempt number two. And all accept his. I, I mean, I want to save him. I need to get in there.
That, I mean, I'm not saving him if I just leave him in the cell. <laughs> Did I just read the note? What note was it? Remember, if you need to remove grading, request a special wrench from form- Yeah. Yeah, I have this. Okay. I have a plan. I have a plan. <laughs> Right, try to get it. Then, if you're smart, you're gonna go around. That's it. That's it. Oh, no, no. No, no, no. No. <laughs> no. <laughs> yeah, but there's a flare there, so you don't want to. I. Stick. Ah, I'm over here. That's it, big boy. That's it. <laughs> Lucas, we gotta go! Quiet, 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 quiet! How can I- Okay, follow me! Follow me! I... I don't... A swift death! And then... I welcome it. I... I don't think he can be saved, guys. We tried. We tried, yeah. I, I, you know, I could, I could, I could save him by leaving him in there. I could do that. You know. I don't know if that's a very fun way to live, though. I think surely he'd rather just die. You know? He's telling you to leave it locked. He wants it. Okay, I mean... That's what he wants. I forgot the flare.
Okay, here we go. Oh, I forgot to do the flare. Holy shit! Holy shit! Holy shit! See you later, buddy! With how much he was freaking out, I thought the monster was already on him. I was charging in there to shoot it. <laughs> to get and go, GET OFF HIM! You know, but he, was, he wasn't even on him yet. SAVED! Got the cutters, lock the cell again without the German prisoner dying. Well done, soldier. Nice. Beautiful. We'll take it. And we got the cutters. Let's go back and get some of the other loot that's in there. I am gonna go pee pee. Be right back. Do you guys ever... <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> Thanks for the 82 months. Oh, nah. Oh, ah, he's gone by now. Went to bed. See you later, man. Um, Thanks for the resubs, guys. Bell! Watch these as 2014. Love you. Will we have a walking Fred ever again? Probably.
Probably not, no, but thank you. Uh, depressing, well, another fun fact, why not I have a related one. There's actually a word for someone giving an opinion on something they know nothing about. An ultra crepidarian is someone who voices thoughts beyond their expertise, kind of like chat, am I right? Or any streamer. I very often make sure that people know that I don't know what I'm talking about if um, I don't, if, if I'm giving an opinion on something that like, you know, I feel like sometimes streamers get asked about anything and it's really just like, what do you think about the, the fucking like, the conflict on this border? Who do you think, what countries? It's just like, what do you want me to say? You know? Um, so I, I try my best to actually state like, I know nothing about this. But I kind of think blah, blah, you know. Yeah. <clears throat> you guys ever shut the fuck up? Don't edge us. I was gonna say it, it'll just, no, you know, it's one of those things that like, it'll come off weird. The proxy war of Syria. Yeah. Yeah, exactly. Uh, I'm curious if someone... It's something about peeing. It is. And I, th I'm, I think that people, I'm hoping people relate. It'll either come off weird because I'm the only one who ever thinks it, or a lot of you guys will relate. Sometimes when I pee, or I've pooed, and I've been on my phone, I've got it in my hand, and I've been sending messages, for example, I'm on like, sometimes I'm on Discord, whatever. And then I, I'm done, and it's time to get up. I take my phone in my right hand, left hand empty, and pull up my pants, right? And like, do you ever worry that you accidentally sent a picture mid pulling up your pants? That's like a fear of mine if I've been DMing and I'm like, oh, did I lock the phone before I did this? Does anyone ever, come on, surely, I get this so often that I'm like pulling up and I've got the phone in my right hand, right? And I go like this. And then, like, right here, I'm like, ooh, I kind of touched the screen while I was doing this. <laughs> and I have to be like, oh, my God, did I just... And then in my head, I'm like, oh, my God, what if I would have sent a dick pic? They would never have believed me if I'm like, oh, my God, I'm so sorry. Like, they would have been like, what the fuck, man? Like, where, you know, I'm seeing, like, I saw, like, four people who agree with me, so I'll take it. Every time I do that, it's so scary. Yes. Good. I'm not the only one. I've definitely thought of that. Okay. Yes. Nice. Yeah. 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 Thanks. Good. Put the phone on the sink. Well, yeah. I mean, sometimes I do. But sometimes I get up and I'm like, whoop. Well, that could have been bad. Like, because you never know, you know, like. Be normal and put your phone down. Yeah. Most of the time. Sure. But every now and then, you've got it in your hand. Imagine going live on Insta. Not like that, but sometimes when I look at not safe for work stuff on my phone, I get anxious about forwarding it, forwarding it to my boss or family members. Interesting. How? <laughs> well, you just sat watching porn and you're like, oh my god. A couple of clicks away. What if I copy the link? Send it to my boss. Not as bad as when I sent a cute photo of my cat to a work group chat. Cat was so cute, I didn't even notice the butt plug box in the back. Did any of them notice? Did any, any of them mention it? Surely not, right? You guys ever forget while scrolling Reddit on the bus that you're in a public setting? And like on Reddit, like every now and then, like not safe for work stuff pops up and you just click it and you're like, staring at like something fully nude you know and you're like oh right i'm on a bus like i should probably <laughs> does that ever happen it happens to me sometimes <laughs> all the time yeah <laughs> a 
privacy? What? So if you look from the side, you can't see anything? It's just black? Wow. You know, even if I had that, I don't think I'd... <laughs> I wouldn't be like, now I'm fine. I can look at whatever I want. <laughs> Gandalf the tractor driver. Welcome, man. Thanks for for subbing. Love the name. New CS2 editions, by the way. <gasps> Hold on. We're going to keep playing, but I want to see what it is. Did they do a CS update? After months of silence. But there's no... They don't do patch notes, huh? They just... All right. Twitter. <clears throat> Bought the wrong thing to buy. What is this? Oh, I'm scared of the replies. Okay. What did that say? Bought the wrong thing meant to buy a different weapon, armor, or grenade. Sell your purchase back and buy again. <gasps> Wait, what the fuck? New menu. This wasn't the menu before, right? In CS2? Hell yeah. Listen, guys. They're allowed to t be inspired by Valorant on something like this. Valorant literally called their best sniper the operator so that because they knew people would be call wanting to be call it the op. So therefore, it still makes sense. All right. Let them. This makes total sense. This is nice. I mean, this. I'm surprised it took this long. God, Counter-Strike players are so starved on good updates. Move it, move it. The fact that this is exciting. Oh, we're both M4s in there? Oh, shit. Huge! There's another tweet. One more tweet. Counter strike. Okay. And we're swapping out Dust 2 for Mirage. Cool. Oh. Any five pistols, any five mid tier weapons and any rif five rifles. Today's Counter-Strike 2 update introduced a revised loadout system where players select 15 weapons from th three categories on CT and T side to bring them with them into matches. What? Bring into matches? What does that mean? Loadout? I don't get it. So you can't fit everything onto the buy screen? Is that why the LMGs weren't in view? Or? Yo, wait, they're not having all weapons available? Controversial. Controversial as hell. Mid tier ninety five. Okay. Ah, uh, really controversial. We'll see how it plays. I'm not going to give any. I'm not going to say it sucks before I've played it. But I think it kind of sucks. <laughs> and here's why: <clears throat> for competitive gameplay, 
you don't need more than those weapons. But in terms of like playing as like a gold Nova, there's so many meme weapons I love throwing on the table during a silly round. And if you limit it to five, right? Five these, five these. Like it's, what am I going to do a couple slots for meme weapons? Like, or am I going to do the five weapons that I'm going to need? The five that I know that I want available, you know? Yeah, exactly. Like, why would I have a negative as one of my ten weapons here? Rather than some other stuff if we're going to try it. But, like, yeah, I think for, like, sweaty competitive, this is kind of cool. But for, like, when you just want to meme for around around and have some fun, I think this is a bit of an odd choice. Hmm. I think it, yeah, it sucks that you can't be like, eh, fuck it, I'm going to put on this shot. Like, I'd have to choose between three shotguns, which one I want in my buy menu. And that alone, I'm like, I, I usually bounce between them sometimes when it's time for a shotgun. So, hmm. Interesting. We'll see how that plays. To be honest, CS has had a lot of updates where people have been like, what? What the fuck? And then it ends up being, ah, it's pretty good. Like, um, the, um, utility update they did, that was re that was a game changer. And people thought it would s ruin the game, but it's actually improved it so much. The fact that you could drop utility. Like, um, so I, I do think they come with some really good updates. And people always question it in the beginning because Counter-Strike's been around for like 25 years. I mean, look at, look at fucking Twist's reaction when they announced CS2 and he just started What have they done to our game? You know, it's just like, well Has this always been here? That's freaky. Um, so we can now open, we now have the um, cutters, but I'd like to go finish in the prison. There's more loot in there I want to grab. Why is that closed? <laughs> what? 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 I I left the others. Do you think they close when the power is off? I think they close when the power is off. Yeah, I think they close when the power is off. Makes 
makes sense for a prison. Yeah, fair. Good point. Did I only did I only open Lucas's cell? I don't know. Can't remember. I did so many attempts. They're all open. You know, it's not really worth. There's, there's, there's not much. <laughs> I'm, there's, there's, yeah, I don't know. There's not much going on here. Let me, let me redo it. <laughs> here we go. I'm gonna bring the cutters because uh, I, I want the inventory space, but the rest of it. Eh? We're gonna do this, and then we're gonna move towards what I believe is the end game. Unless I'll be cock blocked by something. This is enough.
Did Lucas die? <laughs> did he die with that? No, did he? He's fine. He's fine, guys. He's just a little tired. Went for a nap. He's just sleeping, guys. Nice. <clears throat> oh, what a lovely problem to have. Too much stuff. Isn't that great? Uh, let's put some fuel away. Lower difficulty? Nope. Playing on hard quarter. Why are you surprised at how much I'm nailing this? That's what it is, isn't it? I'm gonna bring the gas mask just in case. I'm also gonna bring the torch, although I don't have much left on it, which is a shame. I think there's gonna be rats down there. Bring the meat for that, the rats. Just one bandage. Nice! We do have some notes I want to read. Update on prisoner. Update on prisoner 73014. <laughs> I don't know where this guy's from. With the rest of the cells empty, I have begun a program of aggressive interrogation. I hope the screams have not kept you awake. He continues to insist that he is a common soldier, that his rank was accidentally torn from his uniform, and that he knows nothing of the Second Army's plans. This is an accent? What are you talking about? <clears throat> I do not believe- it's not just my nasal, it's- it- there's a bit of accent here. I do not believe him. Yeah, no, I... <laughs> Sounds like bo bad, like, porn acting. I do not believe him. I've ordered rations for the next three days. Well, <laughs> when next he's fed, I assume his gratitude will loosen his tongue. A final note, this work would be much easier if the officer wine rations were loosened. <laughs> yeah, no, I agree. That sucked. I won't do that again. Um, I did not! I did not hit her! <laughs> that's, that's not a good impression. What? No money? Suck a cock! <laughs> that's a good one, though. Uh... Yeah. Yeah, where the hell is this shop then? Is that an impression where you're just being weird?
What? No money? Yeah, sick a cock. There's like a much longer version of that, like three minutes long. It's um from a porno. Obviously, if, if you couldn't guess it. It's about how she can't pay for the repair of her bike or something. And he comes with all kinds of one-liners. Like, yeah, well, that's, yeah, there's a version of it on YouTube. I think if you look up um, no money porn, I don't know, something like that on YouTube, you'll get the longer version. Suck a cuck. Seen the original? No. No, I am not interested in seeing that man's penis. But there's a longer version on YouTube of all it's a compilation of all the acting in it. Okay, new area. <gasps> Is there a generator here? There's a generator here. Interesting. Can I fill it? I don't actually have any fuel to try. Oh. What, what do I keep? Oh, it's this. Oh. Yeah, do you think if I turn on the generator, this will work, and then it'll suck the water out using this? Oh, yeah, I'm not gonna be able to climb this. We gotta pump it out, unless... Find this. Oh, inventory space. Do I have a nade? Fuck life. Oh my god! Oh my god, he's right behind me. Oh my god! Oh my god! I think that went rather well. <laughs> um, uh, why am I here? Just to suffer. We're gonna go with the med kit. Can I repair this by... No.
I've forgotten what we're doing. Oh, right. Oh, right. Right, yeah. Let's fuel, fuel it up. Pump up the jam. The pump, pump. Nah, it's not a singable song. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I thought maybe I'd find some sort of switch in there. Why not? Why not? Am I missing something? Is that it? I thought I'd find that tube here somewhere. I'm upset. Is it here? No. Oh, I wasn't ready to be stuck again. Turn that on. Is that for later?
might reload. I feel like I'm gonna break my save. I'm gonna... Yeah, I... I don't think that's how I'm meant to do this. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, I was quite proud of that. Uh, yeah, that's my brain. <laughs> um, I need to go update that map and then I'm going to plan. Don't need the generator for this. <sighs> Two tunnels. I just had a realization. I need to go experiment. Oh, I just had I just had a serious realization. My dream isn't dead yet. Power's not on at the moment, no. have all these boxes here. Listen, when you first start this game, it encourages you. It says, anything, any, like, outside-of-the-box thinking you think you can do, give it a try. They encourage you to do stuff like this. Can I walk on planks? We must test it.
truth. You know, I'm just on a whole other level. Now, how much of the game did I just skip? <laughs> what am I meant to do here? There was a developer in my chat yesterday. Are you here? I don't want to know what I'm meant to do. I'm want to, I want to know if I skipped a big part of the game. Or if it was like, oh, you were meant to throw a nade on the boxes and go through. Like, you know, like, I am, I don't like it if I skip the big part of the game. They were here earlier. Damn. I'd love to know. Hmm. Phantom Soul, thanks for the 10 subs. Is that because of how big of a genius I am? <laughs> thanks, man. Are you the dev? Is this a dev? Probably not, right? Because he said, bro, what porn do you watch? Is that you? <laughs> oh, well, that was on subject, wasn't it? Is this the dev? No, this isn't the dev. No, this is just some random dude. Yeah. <laughs> he said, no, you massively overcomplicated an easy solution. You're not the dev, but... What? Why? What was the easy solution? There's no way in here. No, but... No, <laughs> no, listen. No, listen. If... <laughs> no, listen. <laughs> if the water is up, I wouldn't have been able to move that. If, no, but if the water is up, I wouldn't have been able to move that. <laughs> I looked it up. That's the solution. Was that what I was that what I was meant to do? Was I meant to just move that box? And then instead, I create a parkour. <laughs> I create a whole course over the water, hopping over all the way, balancing on planks. I kind of prefer my way, honestly. <laughs> I think my way was way cooler. <laughs> what did you say? What do we think? Dude, I was strafing the walls and shit, like riding the... the surfing. That was great. Strafe jumping. <sighs> Shit. I even went over here. I didn't I didn't actually check. Uh alright.
Am I done? Oh, do I need like a saw or something? What is this? You need to play the correct way to give editor a clip. I think it's pretty obvious when I move that box. Do I win? Is this it? Well, no, wait, I'm only here for the... Oh, God. I'm only here for the deton detonator handle. Then I gotta go back. Oh. Report. Our mad classicist has struck again. No, yeah. Has filed a report there claiming that the Romans used these tunnels to hold sadistic bachanals. Great festivals of cruel combat, torture, and worse. Further, he says these were all held in an arena over a great pit. Any who fell into it fell into screaming darkness. His words. What a poet. I've been in the tunnels. They are tunnels. Full stop. Recommend surveillance on no year. Oh, interesting. So he thinks it's nothing. Had to see what the dark held. Had to. No year, far bear all of them. They don't have the right kind of eyes. There's a world down here full of seductions and secrets. And my eyes are right for it. Never mind that they trapped me down here. I have seen ah, a vision. A vision of a gone world. Bloody and terrible and beautiful and awful. Godly and infernal. All around me voices. The past clawing, spinning, whirling. I don't know what they want. I don't know what they want. Have to stop it, can't see it anymore. It tasks me with what I do not know. Please, God above, if you ever were there, end this. Give me some way to end this. I see it now. <laughs> I see it now. I see it now. See not, see it now, see it not. Whirling and whirling and whirling. It calls for blood. Fuck yeah, dude. You went crazy. Oh shit, I thought that shadow was a guy. Ooh. Oh. Is a lamp saved here? Oh. 
much do we think is left of the game? I thought I was going to end it tonight. But if there's another, like, two hours, then that's another session, I think. It's already 1 a.m. for me. This feels very amnesia. Also, I don't know why I'm asking you guys how much is left of the game. The game came out today, so I doubt you will know. 40 minutes, I think. What are you basing that off of? Do I have an inventory? No. Magic ball says 30 minutes. Google says total game length is four to six hours. Seven. Oh, I'm on the wrong. <laughs> I'm on the wrong game. I have played it for ten. What does that mean? <laughs> what is? Hmm. Good. <laughs> good. This is good. I truly have amnesia. I've been in here for 700 hours. <laughs> you were all playing along every day. Hey guys, we're going live with amnesia again. Looking forward to what's next. This is my 50th playthrough. <laughs> Just... I am playing on hardcore, yeah. I want you all to, all to remember that. I'm playing on a really challenging difficulty here. Um, Alright, let's finish it. I don't think it's that long left. You know, like, I am such a dumbass. <clears throat> I've come down here to find a handle, a detonator handle for dynamite. And I know this, you know? You know how, it, like, I know this. We, we know this. When I came down here, I was like, how, you know, we gotta find the handle, and then we gotta go back. And you know, when I came to this hole, I looked at this and thought, oh, okay, so there's a hammer there that I need. And I thought to myself, I wonder why we need a hammer. And I didn't realize that that's the handle. Because it's highlighted, right? I'm like, that looks really special. I wonder why we need a hammer. I didn't realize that that's the handle until someone in chat... He didn't even, like, correct me because I didn't say it, right? He was just like, ooh, well, it depends on how quick you can get that handle. You know, and I'm sat here thinking it's a fucking hammer. Like, I... I'm amazing. Amnesia always gets weird. <laughs> like the second, like the end of the first amnesia, the end, the last phase, it gets funky. And the end of amnesia rebirth, it gets funky. And in this, it's getting funky. It, al it always gets weird, doesn't it? Alright, what do we have? We have some bottles. We have a fuel bottle, a grenade, gas mask. It's a shame I never found the shotgun. I have shells for a shotgun. Smeagol vibe on this guy.
It. I can't. I can't do a smiggle. It all gets lost. Lost Hobbits. in a blinding twirl. I suspect this man is blind, judging by how many bottles we're getting. Wait, who's walking behind me? What the fuck? Okay, so this guy has a shotgun and there's a freak down here. Um... We will rock you. What will come next around the bend? We will. <laughs> he starts. He starts. <laughs> he just <laughs> gets really into it. <laughs> I heard it, yeah. That's so high, man. Quiet. That turns men into grisade. There's multiple Bro, why am I down here? Why why am I down here? bro oh no did your friend die too
We world the world. A world we world. What? Are we playing multiplayer down here or something? Why is there a guy running around? We world the world. The world we world. It's a scab. Hello? Did you turn VoIP on? Excuse me, sir. I'm a little confused. Can you help me? Hello? Could you... Hello? I swear I saw you there. No? I saw a guy there. We world the world. Salvation comes to those who wait. There was, I'm going crazy. goes back. Where can I put this? Is there something climbable here? I don't know what I'm meant to do down here. All the doors are locked. Oh, you know what? Let me clear. Okay, that's, that's gonna be my escape route. The bottle. Oh yeah, carry more items. Okay, and we grab it. Indiana Jones style, it's gonna start. No? Okay. wearing a gas mask in there? Do you think all the smoke and shit was making me crazy? <gasps> I'm back where I saved Lambert in the intro. Oh, it's so beautiful though. Once again, we're reminded that the nightmare that we face in here isn't everything. Out here, 
this war is still going on. But to us, this is no longer a priority. Borders no longer a thing. It's really, oh, it's a lovely way to, to remind us of what's going on. Did I get any notes while in there? Sorry, I was trying to get Lambert stuff. Oh. Hmm. So did he die here? No, no, he didn't die here because I found. No, 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 he didn't die here. He did, however, suck the bad juice. Interesting. Lambert, buddy. Might have sentimental value to someone can be thrown. What is it Lambert said in his note? Where is he? When he was down here? And then Clement faced that- I appeared, lowered myself to him, found a trickle of spring water. And I made him drink from it. It was cool and crisp with a strange sweet taste. Never has water felt more nourishing than that. Then he got wounded by the thing. Woke this morning and realized that the toy I purchased for my son is gone. I've got that now. Don't worry, I've got it. Spoke to the doctor, told me, hon, yeah, so from the sermon, I'm feeling rather good, stronger and stronger. Interesting. I mean, the most obvious conclusion to make is that the water fucked Lambert up and he became the monster. But we'll find out. Who he sounded like? The guy down here? He sounded like Willem Dafoe. Okay, you're really. F okay, wow, it's done. Okay. Oh. Wow, it's done really well. Yeah, he sounded like Willem Dafoe. In, like, uh, the lighthouse. Was there another door? No, oh, I checked all doors. That room I made it into had two doors that led into it. The other one was just, I opened it from the other side. Out, am I? Such a good line. <laughs> Out, am I? Mm. He'll never top that one line.
Okay. Let's go, uh, make him see the light by giving him the rabbit. Good ending coming up. I'm gonna get the great ending. Oh, whoa, oh. No, there were two guys in there, because when I threw the grenade, there was a second body. Now go open Lambert's um, closet. This is Lambert. The 12th of July, thing. 1916. Up again. In the chapel. Trying to pray, but my mind is too alive with thoughts of the crater. The rabbit. And that water. Its taste. And yet I don't feel tired. Instead I feel this. Okay, I'll read this. It's a little quicker. And yet I don't feel tired. Instead I feel this itch. This sense that there are things I must do. Purpose. A bloody purpose higher than any of man's petty wars. Morning. Everyone's talking about hearing scratching at the walls. Tremblay even claims to have heard howls echoing through the barracks. I feel strange myself. Can barely find the words to write. My hands feel so odd. Gnarled. Bulbous. Like they don't belong to me. Ooh. So do you think... He, in the night, was going around howling and, and, and killing people. And that's why his hands feel aw odd and gnarled and bulbous. I hesitate to write this, but a thought keeps echoing in my head. A thought I must not act on. A bloody thought so seductive. It calls. It calls. It calls! Madness in the barracks this morning. Renard's dead. They say murder, but will not show us the body. A dream rises in my mind, countless cruel eyes upon me. Must check on Henri, wish he would wake, could use a friend. My prayers remain unanswered. Three days later. Blood on my hands, blood on my hands. Blood on my hands. Their pain, I want more of it. I can hear Tremblant now. Coming. Coming. <laughs> Coming closer. 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 I can get what I want from him. Three days. Wow. He's just fucking them up.
The time has come to finish this. have the dynamite on me. Before I go, I have one last thing I need to do. Lambert. Lambert! It's me, Henri! Lambert! Where are you, Lambert? I have your daughter's plushie. Come, Lambert. You may no fear feel any- What? <laughs> Lambert, you don't have to fear- Feel fear anymore. Take it. That's it. Your daughter, remember her. Remember her. Beautiful. And now? What a beautiful moment. And with that, we leave. Ah! Let's pretend I landed here from the start. <laughs> Lucas is dead. I fucked him up with a grenade. Oh, right, yeah, no, he's sleeping. Luke's just sleeping. Give him a nice pill.
done. <laughs> this is the end of the game. Hey, you know, very Amnesia 1, this. This is am in, in the, uh, towards the end of uh, the first Amnesia. Come to a place that looks very much like this. Okay. Welcome back, Lambert. Thought we did a whole goodbye scene, but... No, this is... This is cool, too. Nice boss fight here. Okay. Hello. Get a nice good look at you. Nice, good start. Lambert, I gave you your daughter's plushie. That should be enough. Is he coming? Whoopsie daisy. Let's. Shit. I've got a parkour now. Or I'm dead. Jump! Okay. No! Oh my god! Okay. 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 We're just gonna. Holy fuck! Clutch! And we leave! What the fuck? Okay. Lambert fucks them all up. Wow. You know, sometimes horror games have a really underwhelming end to them. 10 out of 10 ending. From start to finish, loved the story. Claps in chat. My... This might be my game of the year. I really like this. I really like this. This was really nice. <clears throat> we don't get a lot of high quality horror games where it's not cheap scares, the gameplay's entertaining, the story's good. From start to finish, it doesn't get boring. This. This might be my game of the year, personally. Just because I, I really enjoyed it. That was a really nice, really, really nice experience. I found Amnesia, Amnesia Rebirth to be quite underwhelming. I thought it, it was well made, but it's just a little underwhelmed by it. But this, this was what an homage to their first amnesia as well. It was done really well. Oh, I really liked that. It was such a good- they, they really combined like Penumbra, the good parts of Penumbra, with all the physical kind of stuff in Penumbra. They combined that with the good parts of the first amnesia. And then they threw in a killer story. I really liked that they did like a World War One thing. Um... That felt very refreshing. And I was like really into the, um... I'm not usually that into notes, but the notes were done super well. I was learning a lot just reading the notes. In a game like this, you need to do the story through notes, because there isn't much... If you're the only one running around, everyone's dead, like, it, you need to tell the story that way, and, um... I thought that they were done really well. They were written well. I, uh, I really liked that. 
Well done. Well done to Frictional Games. What did you guys think? Yeah, when I get up to the bunker and I get reminded that, oh my god, the war is still going on. This is in the middle of World War One. Like, they don't care that I'm going through this. They're going to kill me if I go. Like, there were so many scenes like that where it was like, ah, oh, they, they clearly put a lot of work into this. I, I, ooh, I really liked it. There's probably a few more notes you can find. I, I think there were a couple of places I didn't fully explore, but I do think I... I would estimate I looked at probably 90% of story-based stuff. I, th I think I looked... I went through most stuff. You let Lambert live. Do you think I could have killed... Maybe there's two endings. Do you think I could have killed him rather than poor care... Poor parkour out with him after? I wonder. Finished the game, collected all the other achievements. What? 23 out of 42. <laughs> huh? My... What I don't get it. There are two endings? Ooh. What's the other ending? Yeah, let's go look. Ooh, difficulty mode, hard. Time played, 4 hours 51. Was I paused for 5 hours? Or what the fuck does that mean? I think, yeah, reading notes probably doesn't count as time played. Okay, no, that's good. No, we didn't spend five hours reading notes. <laughs> no, no. Yeah, it'll be because when I die, it doesn't count that time. This is only counting the parts that succeeded. That's it. That's it. Otherwise, I would have spent more time reading notes than doing actual gameplay. Longest time between saves, 14 minutes. Time saved, 63. Number of death, only 16. Rats killed, 24. Bullets fired, 24. <laughs> it really looks like I spent every bullet shooting rats. <laughs> I just... oh, that's such a funny coincidence. <laughs> I just, every bullet I find, I shoot a rat. Shotgun shells fired one. Grenades thrown eight. Gas grenades one. Petrol but oh, I didn't throw any of them. I threw one, I think, but I never blew it up. Flares thrown. But this only counts when I lived, I think, because I did throw a petrol bomb. I must have died. I don't know, actually. Flares thrown six. No, okay, I think this is when I died, because I did not throw six in my successful attempts. Health items used 13, generator reflux 33, blackouts 10. The fuck is a blackout? Traps triggered 21, corpses burnt 4. Oh, I could be burning corpses. I didn't even. Okay. Fires started 0. Doors. Really? Doors destroyed 16, time spotted by Stalker 38, items crafted 12. Stalker bullet hit count. That must be the guy who's walking around. Maybe? And each pellet of the shotgun or something? I don't know. Rats scared by Torch 39. Yeah, fuck them. That's Lambert? He's called the Stalker? Okay. I thought maybe... Oh, yeah, no, it's time spotted by Stalker. Yeah, you're right. Congratulations to finish your first playthrough of Amnesia the Bunker. Remember, no playthrough of the bunker is the same as any other. Items, traps, codes, and more are all random. Play again and experience the horror in you. Wow. Custom stories. Ooh. Yeah, 
I don't know. That just seems to be an example anyway. Is there a workshop? No. I guess you have to load them, put them in like a folder or something. Cool. Wait! Browse Steam Workshop. What? I don't think they got it approved yet. They must be waiting for approval or something. I could go back and play some custom stories. There, the OG Amnesia has hundreds of really good stories. Some really fleshed out stories with like custom monsters and stuff. If that happens to this, I could totally go and play some good ones. I think that'd be fun. Like, it, 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 like they do a whole new thing. There were some insane modded stories back in the day for the original Amnesia that sometimes were even scarier than the OG. I mean, obviously PewDiePie played a shitload of them, but like eventually you started seeing other kinds of monsters and stuff. Like it, it, I, re I remember it was, it was crazy. So I could see them doing with that, with this. Um, I want to see the other ending. <clears throat> ah, playtime eight hours. Why did it change? True ending. Well, how does he do this? I want to see if he parkours. I think that's what you were meant to do. It just breaks from all the shaking, I guess. Ya boy skips it. I just fucking parkour it. Alright, so that's the one I got, right? And then... Gotta parkour it. There we go. There we go, buddy. Get out of there, man. No. What? No, you... You were on the right track, man. Oh, buddy. There we go, there we go!
Okay, I mean, like, you're... Okay, here we go. Here we go. Yeah, nice. You don't need it that close. Okay, yeah, I mean... Yeah, all right. Okay, we're... <laughs> yeah, this guy's trying to get to the 10 minute mark. He's... <laughs> yeah. That was our ending. You know, of the two endings, I like mine. Mine was cool as hell. Come out there, shoot him, I parkour out, he follows me and he's released into the wild. Very cool ending. The one where you set up a trap and make him die, I feel is a little too typical. You know what I mean? I like these kind of open endings where it's like, oh my god, this thing was released into, into the wild. In the middle of World War One. you know? Hmm. Yeah, and I was like, Chase, dropping the grenade, like, I, I think it was a lot of fun. Yeah. Really, really nice game. Let's give it a nice review. So, Marco mentioned, he said that he thinks it removed it because it counts, Steam looks at how long you were AFK and removes that from playtime. Really cool. When the first Amnesia um, came out many years ago, I fell in love with the horror genre in games. Since then, I have played many horror games, but the and and. Enjoyed getting the crap scared out of me. Amnesia. Frictional games. When the first Amnesia came out many years, I fell in love with the horror genre in games. Play, um... I found Penumbra shortly thereafter as well. Since then, I have played many horror games and dragging the crap scared out of me. Frictional games games, however, haven't quite hit the nail on it, the head in terms of haven't quite captured hadn't didn't quite capture the original feeling of the first amnesia for me. Until now. <laughs> amnesia the bunker is a fantastic return to horror to true to the true horror I felt playing running around the mansion all those years ago until uh, um, I can do nothing but recommend this to anyone looking for a good story with um, with uh, um, uh, an amazing scary atmosphere. 10 out of 10. This is my game of the year, personally.
When the first Amnesia came out many years ago, I fell in love with the horror genre in games. I found Penumbra shortly thereafter as well. Since then, I don't need the Penumbra bit. Um, with the horror genre in games. Since then, I have played many horror games and enjoyed getting the crap scared out of me. Frictional games games, however, didn't quite capture the original feeling of the first Amnesia for me. Until now. Until now. <laughs> Amnesia the Bunker is a fantastic return to the true horror I felt running around the mansion all those years ago. I can do nothing but recommend this to anyone looking for a good story with an amazing, scary atmosphere. 10 out of 10 is my game of the year, personally. That's good. What do you guys think? It's a good review. World record for this game currently is 1 minute and 49 seconds. Wow. On day one, huh? Frictional Games Games. Yeah, their name is Frictional Games. So Frictional Games Games. <laughs> 